The weather today didn't stop Detroiters from showing up to grab a good seat. Fortunately, that rain let up just in time for the show. The weather was not going to rain on their parade. Kelly Vaughn continues our team coverage tonight of those fireworks from, from Belle Isle. Hey, Kelly. Hey guys, you know, as Terrell mentioned, people got here early, so there was a lot of time to get rained on, and we certainly did. People running in and out, hiding under umbrellas, hiding in their tents. Everyone had to protect the grill and what was on the grill, but you know, everybody here, we made it work. Energy was high on Belle Isle with so many ready for the fireworks, but would the rainy weather bring them down? Not at all. Not at all. I'm, no. no, we're ready. Not really. I feel like rain, rain is beautiful to me. 11 year old Kamari Conyers hasn't seen the fireworks since before the pandemic. She says the weather just adds to the experience. And when it rains, I feel like the fireworks will look more beautiful yeah. in the sky. For Nita Browning, this was the first time she's taken her daughter to see the fireworks. And nothing was keeping us from down here today. The event was filled with kids running and playing in the stretches of sunshine, families keeping their traditions alive. And when the rain came, they were prepared. Listen, I got my car. I have two umbrellas. We have blankets, snacks. chairs, snacks. Just fine. We are fine. <laughs> this is Michigan. We can't yeah. get wrong. We, we know rain is coming at some point. You know, they tell me that the fireworks are a tradition, but rain during the fireworks is basically a tradition at point at this point. Um, so nobody was too worried about it, and they plan to come back next year, rain or shine. For now, reporting live from Belle Isle, Kelly Vaughn, CBS News, Detroit. Having a great time regardless. I'm Making sure lemonade. it was a great show as well, right, Kelly? Oh, yeah. I mean, it got a little smoky, but it was still yeah. good. <laughs> All right. Thank you very much, Kelly.